Mark Zuckerberg claims he regressed came into the White House in a stunning interview. You know, I've done some stuff personally in the past. I'm not planning on doing that this time. Um, and that includes, you know, not endorsing either of the candidates. He also bigs up Trump for doing a fist bump. You know, I mean, seeing Donald Trump get, get up after getting shot in the face and pump his fist in the air with the American flag is one of the most badass things I've ever seen in my life. He even caused Trump to have a conversation. First of all, he called me a few times. He called me after the event and he said that was really amazing. It was very brave. And, you know, and he actually announced he's not going to support a Democrat because he can't because he respected me for what I did that day. And he briefly explains the direction he plans on taking Facebook. I, I, I view our role here is to make it so that everyone can express their, their views on this stuff. Um, but we're going to try to manage it so that way the politics doesn't drown out the human connection and the community, which is, I think, the main thing that people come to our services for. We're also going to unpack Jordan Peterson's reasoning for voting for Trump if he was an American. If you were psychoanalyzing Trump and Kamala Harris, what would you conclude right now based on everything you've seen and heard? All that on today's show, plus more.